Two eight five one, turn right heading one eight zero. Hello everyone, welcome to DJ's Aviation. In today's video, I bring you another positive on the latest aircraft to be released in the A350 series. Just two days ago, the very first Airbus A350 ULR, or Ultra Long Range, completed its first flight. The A350 ULR is of course a modified A350-900 and is the heavier and longer in range which is tailored specifically to operate on you guessed it, long haul routes only. The first A350 ULR departed from Toulouse on the 23rd of April. These A350 ULRs are hit with Singapore Airlines who have 7 on order. This is part of their commitment for 67 of the A350-900s. The airline who will operate a Singapore to New York service initially with this ULR variant are set to take delivery of the aircraft later this year. They also aren't the only carrier interested in the capabilities of this aircraft. Qantas have also been rumoured to be heavily interested in it as well. Airbus has said the A350 ULR is capable of flying for up to 20 hours without stopping and this aircraft will rival the Boeing 777-8 which is still yet to be released and won't be ready until 2022. The head of the A350 marketing program has obviously understood how daunting it can be for some to fly for up to 20 hours without stopping and has said that everything is made to have a comfortable long haul experience. The A350 ULR is certainly changing the game with the potential for new routes you never would have thought possible opening up. However, it still does beg the question, would you fly for up to 20 hours from let's say Singapore to New York in general? I'm set on my opinion which is a firm no. This came about just from looking at the Perth to London service. While I haven't flown many long haul flights, I know a stopover can do a great deal in terms of stretching your legs. But I've also found as someone who is heavily interested in aviation that it's actually fantastic to experience different airports and in a more general way the culture of that country you are in, even if it's only for a two hour period. So would you fly for up to 20 hours without a stop? I'd honestly love to hear your views on this in the comment section below as I believe it makes for a hopefully healthy discussion. Thank you very much for watching this video of mine and I do hope to see all of you in my next one. Oh, 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 oh,